Puts the shoulder down, takes the jumper in. Bill Cartwright just shook his head. Well, you have to. That was a prime time shot. Just one of three, make it two of four tonight. Doesn't get it, starts with the rebound, lots of timeout with 116 left. And the Chicago Bulls clinging to a six-point advantage, 102-96. They'll take the best. They'll look for the two, but if they get an open three, naturally they'll take it. Two-man game, Hubert Davis and Ewing. Ewing inside, count the basket for Patrick Ewing. The lead is down to four. That's it on Pippen. Shot clock at three. Pippen, the ball fake, the shot won't go. Cartwright the rebound, and the Knicks take it away. No whistle. We'll go the other way with it. With 39 left, Cartwright got away with a with a push that time. Right. That's how he received that rebound. Ewing's hit a three in game two. He's going to take it inside. Count it. It's a two-point ball game. Plus, the Knicks are going to get this ball back with time. You cannot run the clock. There are five seconds difference here now. Now this is critical. He wants a timeout. With 13 on the shot clock, 17.9. What a tremendous job by the Knicks in the fourth quarter again. And now he calls a 20. Hang on, I think the Knicks have, or the Bulls have just changed it to a 20. The Knicks double team Pippen. All right, they're going 1 4 right now, looking for the spot up off the dribble. The clock is at 6. Pippen with three on the shot clock. He's not going to get a good shot off. 2-1. No, they're going to call a violation. That is a shot clock violation. The Knicks with one timeout left have a chance to win, tie the basketball game and win it with a three. Now remember, the Knicks have no timeouts remaining. None. So this is critical. You know that they want to try to get Ewing in this play. And start. There's Ewing. Ewing for the tie. He's got it with 1.8 left. A sensational play. And they call a timeout right as they brought the ball in. Can you believe what just happened? I cannot believe. Ryan's inbound that ball to Scotty Pippen with 1.8 seconds to go rather than call a timeout when you had three timeouts remaining. Unbelievable. Now keep an eye on it. Ewing is coming in. You know they're going to Ewing. This is his 34th point of the game. He is now 14 for 19 from the field. Nine rebounds, four assists, and two blocks. We'd like to show you Patrick Ewing making a sweeping hook shot. The first one of the night. New York in this quarter, 11 for 16 in this quarter. 69%. Chicago, only five for 15. You know they're going into Ewing. He's had such a special evening. 14 for 19 from the field for a total of 34 points. 1.8 left. No timeouts left for the Bulls. Myers triggers the inbounds pass. Kukoc for the win. 